cat mummy is really exciting. It says here that it's a fake cat mummy. But what's really interesting is that it is an ancient fake cat mummy. So what we have here is a really brilliant patterning of linen that you would see on a, on a real cat mummy. But what the priest did here was actually include just a couple unidentified bones and not a real cat. So it seems like they were kind of cheating a little bit, the ancient pilgrim that would have bought this to then donate it at a temple site. It's probably associated with the cat goddess Bastet, so it could have been purchased to donate at her temple or a temple that would be associated with her. But so so interesting that there would have been such uh, care given to the different geometric patterns here on the linen, but not actually have a cat inside. Now the geometric patterns tell us that this dates to the Roman period, which was the last period of what we think of as pharaohs, the Roman emperors themselves. So this is about 30 BC. And we know that at this period, pilgrimages to temples were exceptionally important for people from all over the ancient world. So it very well could have been that this this uh, donation was from someone from outside of Egypt itself and that came and purchased this so-called fake cat.